welcome to this edition of the Our Daily Bread devotional. I'm Bill Crowder, and I titled our reading, How Great is Our God? Fingerprints have long been used to identify people, but they can be faked by creating copies. Similarly, the pattern of the iris in the human eye is a reliable source for ID until someone alters the pattern with a contact lens to skew the results. The use of biometrics to identify individuals can be defeated. So what qualifies as a unique identifying characteristic? It turns out that everyone's blood vessel patterns are unique and virtually impossible to counterfeit. Your own personal vein map is a -a one-of-a-kind identifier setting you apart from everyone else on the planet. Pondering such complexities of human beings should prompt a sense of worship and wonder for the Creator who made us. David reminded us in Psalm 139 that we are, quote, fearfully and wonderfully made. And that is certainly worth celebrating. In fact, Psalm 111, verse 2 reminds us, Great are the works of the Lord. They are pondered by all who delight in them. Even more worthy of our attention is the Divine Maker Himself. While celebrating God's great deeds, we also must celebrate Him. His deeds are great, but He's even greater, prompting the psalmist to pray, For you are great and do marvelous deeds. You alone are God. Today, as we consider the greatness of what God does, may we also marvel at the greatness of who He is. Today's Our Daily Bread devotional scripture reading is from Psalm 111, verses 1 through 10. Praise the Lord. I will extol the Lord with all my heart in the counsel of the upright and in the assembly. Great are the works of the Lord. They are pondered by all who delight in them. Glorious and majestic are his deeds, and his righteousness endures forever. He has caused his wonders to be remembered. The Lord is gracious and compassionate. He provides food for those who fear Him. He remembers His covenant forever. He has shown His people the power of His works, giving them the lands of other nations. The works of His hands are faithful and just. All His precepts are trustworthy. They are established forever and ever, enacted in faithfulness and uprightness. He provided redemption for His people. He ordained His covenant forever. Holy and awesome is His name. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. All who follow His precepts have good understanding. To Him belongs eternal praise. Let's pray. Father, we can easily be sidetracked into thinking so much about creation that we don't really consider You the one who made all of creation. Help us to marvel at you as we look at the things that you have made. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thanks for listening today. My name is Bill Crowder, and today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.